Alright, uh, this technique here is uh, mainly used uh, for, uh, usually I use it for post-op rotator cuff uh, when you want to facilitate external rotation and flexion, um, but it's either too painful uh, or you just want to make it uh, done uh, a lot better and, and short. So uh, the uh, AP glide of the humeral head is, is very safe and it helps seat, seat the humeral head a little bit better and it glenn away. Um, so what I usually find is sometimes when you do uh, external rotation passively is that it, it can get very painful because the uh, patient's shoulder is going forward uh, because of boarding um, in sling, something of that extent. So a simple adjustment to that is, um, is to provide just a, a really graded, a small graded amount of motion, uh, anterior to posterior glide the humeral head as you bring them out in external rotation. Um, typically, you'll get immediate results and improvement in range of motion. Um, it should be less painful too. And it just builds more confidence from, uh, from the patient to yourself as well. So uh, normally this will be kind of an approach I would do. And you can take it from here and do the same thing into elevation. As you bring it to elevation, you can ride and just sit the humeral head a little bit better. So instead of just doing this as a passive technique without having any hand contact, just add that extra contact there for better results.